Welcome to temporary duty, man. You ain't mad. I'm Staff Sergeant Jim Shorten. The S-1 asked me to show you around. I'll be like a voice in your head till you get your shit squared away. This shit hole is pliku. Try not to breathe in the dust, or you'll be coughing all night. Jump in the quarter ton. We'll head out to the range. It's on the other side of the flight line. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be playing a new DLC for Armor Free. Uh, it's called SOG Parifier. Uh, this is a um, Vietnam War themed DLC. Uh, launched just around a week ago. Uh, it's a new DLC after... We haven't seen any new DLC since uh, Global Mobilization. So uh, let's see how this DLC fares against the uh, Contact DLC and also Global Mobilization DLC. It gets so, kind of busy here. Liku is a launch site for all kinds of ops. I did my first tour here in the Navy down at Da Nang. And I volunteered for Airborne, just like you. Hey, if you get a free night in Saigon, check out the Giddy Bar. They got a chick there by the name of Yen. Tell her Jimmy sent you. So right now we we are at uh, Play Ku Air Base at uh, in South Vietnam. It's located uh, in in the uh, Central Highlands. Uh, we just uh, drove past a Apple Phantom taxi. We are currently heading towards the range. Uh, right now we're in the Jeep and you can see uh, the, the drive, there's, they have implemented the uh, gear shifting uh, animation which is pretty cool. So whenever you're driving the Jeep, uh, when you shift gears, uh, you can see your right hand on the uh, uh, stick shifter and your left leg is stepping on the clutch. Armed Forces Vietnam Radio. The music is sweet, but the ads suck. That button snatcher dude needs to get fragged. Okay, so on the table we have uh, M16, M14, and the M40 sniper rifle. Let's try out the M16 first. The Army sure stiffed us with these new plastic rifles. Remember to only load 18 rounds in each mag, or the weak springs will cause it to jam right when you don't want it to. Okay, so um, the narrator did mention uh, to load only 18 rounds in the max because uh, of a, a weak uh, magazine spring. Uh, so if you stuff uh, all 20 rounds, it, 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 the uh, spring may not have enough strength to push the round upwards to feed the, the rounds into the chamber. Uh, so which may cause like misfire or all kinds of malfunction. Which is pretty common when the uh, M16 first fielded to the uh, units in Vietnam. Uh, I would, I, I wish I could say this is the only problem, but apparently there's more problem with this rifle. Okay, enough said. Uh, let's just fire a uh, single fire mode. So now I'm gonna try and fire in uh, full auto. Uh, it's, you can you can also have um, melee uh, option as well, which is new in Armor Free. So uh, I just need to switch, hit F to switch fire mode, and switch to melee, and just hit the fire button. Ha! 
you can see uh, your character is trying to hit, uh, you know, whatever's in front of him with the uh, right butt of the rifle. Okay, so we have uh, two types, or actually three types of magazines available. So we get a 20 round mag, the uh, 30 round magazines, and also the uh, two uh, 20 round mags sticking together. It's a 20 round mag duel. And for the rifle, we can have a rifle scope, just a normal uh, three times uh, scope, and a starlight, uh, which is a night vision scope. And we can mount a bayonet, which is, I mean, you can uh, this uh, the bayonet option feature. Uh, you can actually see it in unsung mode, but. It's the first time that a uh, bayonet uh, feature has been introduced in uh, in the official uh, game. Suppressor, no surprise, uh, no bipod. Okay. This is the scope. As you can see, there's a slight bullet drop because I I'm aiming on top of the target yet and uh, score a headshot. Okay, enough firing on this weapon. Gonna try out the M14. A 7.62 rifle. It's much better for putting the VC down. It just weighs a lot more than a 16. You can get some fancy parts for it too. Okay, so for this rifle, we got the, the sniper scope and the starlight. You can also uh, mount the bayonet, a suppressor, and a camo wrap for the M14, which is pretty cool. But I like it. Uh, the you know the um, is it chestnut or pine wood uh, a texture? Okay, single fire. And full auto. Okay, gonna try the sniper rifle. Ah, so you're a sharpshooter. Plenty of use for this on perimeter watch. VC sappers creeping through the minefields, brave motherfuckers. If you don't want to bolt it right away, keep the trigger pressed to watch your fall a shot. This is the uh, M40 uh, sniper rifle, 762 caliber. So if we don't want to uh, uh, cycle the bolt right away, we can keep pressing the uh, keep the trigger uh, button pressed to watch our sh shots. So I'm gonna try it now. Now I'm gonna release the trigger uh, button. Okay, gonna fire again. But this time I'm gonna release the trigger as soon as I fire. And on this table we got the uh, shotgun, the M60, the M79 Thumper, and the M2 Carbine. The Carbine is issued to your A-Team Indigs. They don't weigh so much. Good for humping in the boonies. Okay, 
like the uh, this is the M2 Carby. Uh, I think the caliber is uh, 45 caliber, uh, same as the M1 carbine used in World War One. Uh, for the M2 carbine, features a 30, ca uh, 30 round magazine and also capable of firing full auto. So just gonna fire a few rounds in, sing uh, in semi auto. Okay, going for auto. Okay, we can mount a scope on it, a bayonet. No suppressors of bipod. However, there's another uh, variant for the M2 carbine. Uh, it is outfitted with the uh, night vision goggle. It is experimental. Uh, not sure. Uh, how proliferated uh, this equipment was uh, back in the days in Vietnam. Okay, and we have the M79. The M79 launcher. is a game changer in a tight spot. With practice, you can drop 40 millimeter grenades right in Charlie's lap. It has HE, flares, smoke, dual purpose, and buckshot. For buckshot, press your fire mode key. We get a few rounds of uh, HE, a few rounds of airburst, uh, CS gas, and also buckshot. So I'm gonna try try out the uh, HE. So I'm gonna try and aim at the furthest uh, targets. I would say around 125 meters. Of firing. Fire it again. I'm gonna try out the air burst. Uh, I'm not sure whether that was air burst or I need to set the uh, fuse or something like that. It doesn't look air burst to me. Anyway, you're gonna try the CS gas. The CS gas uh, sh uh, should be the uh, uh, it's the abbreviation for t ga tear gas. Uh, you can see the smoke is slowly developing. Yeah, um, so the the smoke is developing and it is affected by the wind direction, so be aware of uh, the wind direction when you're deploying uh, tear gas. Okay, now I'm gonna try out the buckshot. So buckshot is like just a canister shot with uh, shoots nothing, uh, shoots like a lot of uh, ball bearings. Uh, it's effective at close range. Gonna tr try out at this cluster of uh, targets. Wow, I mean the spread is pretty wide, and it covers a quite a large area. You can see the uh, the impact on the ground when the ball bearing hits the dirt. Okay, what's next? We got the shotgun. This sucker was used as a trench gun in the First World War. You got flechette or buckshot, and it slam fires if you hold down the trigger. Great right when you're walking point, and if you're some kind of psycho, it has a 10-foot bayonet. Okay, time to go. 
The slick will take you on up to Quan Loy. You'll be able to get in some real practice up there. It gets hot, especially at night. You can see when you hit, uh, choose the melee um, mode, uh, your character will try to stab uh, the target in front of it with the uh, bayonet. <laughs> Let me get some uh, buckshot for this gun. The spread is uh, narrower compared to the M79 buckshot. Uh, the range, however, I think is further. Yeah, definitely. I think the sh it has a longer range compared to the M79. And I like the uh, reload animation, how it puts like one round into the chamber and the uh, remaining uh, five rounds in the mag tube. So apparently if I hold down the trigger, uh, it will just continue fire until it runs off ammo. Nice. Okay, let's uh, try the pig, the M60 uh, General Burst machine There's gun. There's no comfortable way to carry the pig, but man, she can put some lead out. Okay, let me try and fire it when standing. I mean, uh, look at if you look at that modeling, it's pretty detailed. Not compared to like you know, CUP or uh, Unsun mod. Oh, and over here we got the 1911 uh, 45 caliber pistol and the M3 grease gun. Always good to stay in practice with your sidearm. Just pray you'll never need it. I told you never need it. Got their grease gun. You'll see a lot of pilots and drivers carrying the grease gun. It's small and definitely beats a handgun at close range. Some A team guys use them suppressed. Okay, let's try it out. Uh, oh, it's only full auto, so let's see. Uh, you can see the dust cover actually rattles as you fire. Which is pretty cool. Okay, that's it. So that's uh, all of the available weapons uh, on the range. So now we'll check out the static weapons. Well, these big guns are good for camp defense. Try them all. The meat grinder's my favorite. Four barrels of mayhem, and Charlie don't like it one bit. Right now, we are firing the uh, 30 cal, uh, the Browning 30 cal, which is fielded during World War II. 
they have a heavier, a uh, heavy ver uh, version. So instead of air cooled, they have like a water jacket covering the barrel and a hose connecting to the pump and the reservoir. So it actually used the uh, water cooling to cool on the barrels. So for this version, we have the uh, air cooled. So there's a, a metal sleeve with holes that which helps uh, con to take the heat away from the barrel. Okay, over then over here we got the M60. Uh, I think it, this is the vehicle version. So they have, let's see, they have removed the foregrip and the heat shield on the front, and uh, removed the kind of removed the bus dog and the pistol grip for the trigger. They added like the M50 uh, cal, uh, Browning 50 cal style uh, grip, and. Uh, to fire, you need to hold down the butterfly tr uh, trigger with both of your thumb. Where we, uh, apparently, it takes quite a lot of pressure to fire it. Uh, they have changed the weapon sight as well. Uh, this is more like an anti-air uh, gun sight. And uh, also, there's a tin can welded to the feeding tray, which helps uh, uh, keep the f uh, angle of feeding, the feeding angle level. Uh, to avoid any jam or the uh, belt snagging or got caught uh, and you know uh, cause a stoppage. Uh, this I think this is the uh, the helicopter gunner uh, version of the M60. See if I can hit the uh, uh, FO Phantom. Okay, we have the fifty cal over here. God, look at the muscle. Uh, the muscle. The flash hider, uh, the be uh, muzzle, it's enormous, uh, enormous. And he, over here we got the Quad 50, uh, this was origi originally designed as an anti-air uh, weapon platform but during the uh, f f during World War II, but during World, uh, Vietnam War they used it on uh, gr ground defense uh, positions against uh, enemy infantry. Wow, I feel bad for the uh, loader. They have like, f they have four 50 cows to load. And I believe the uh, the two 50 cows on the right. Uh, I, I'm not sure whether uh, you can change the feeding direction from uh, left to right to uh, right to left uh, just by simple modification, or you need to send back to the uh, the shop, uh, workshop for the gunsmith to actually uh, adjust it.
And you can turn the shield up or down to avoid getting hit. Uh, at the back, I think this is the uh, car battery. Or the battery cell to um, provide power to the motor so you can actually uh, traverse and elevate uh, the guns. Okay, then over here we got the uh, rocket launcher. We got two types of rocket. The new M72 is funky. You only get one shot. We use a lot of captured B-40s, as you can reload them. Rockets are great against bunkers and for breaking up waves coming at the wire. Pray that don't happen. This is the M70 Law, uh, Law stands for Light Anti-Tank Weapon. It's a 66mm uh, disposable rocket launcher. So it's uh, usually uh, when stowed, it's in a collapsed position. So to use it, let's see, uh, one, pull this ring, two, uh, grab here and open thing, disengage. So just uh, remove the safety feature and pull the back side and extend the uh, rocket launcher. Uh, pull ball handle to extend and lock. And I can't see uh, step four and five. Warning, do not remove safety pin before extending launcher. And two, replace safety... I can't read, but it's at the bottom. Okay, so let's try to fire at the fan behind the wrecked helicopter wreck. So, back blast area clear. Rocket. Damn it. It actually um, um, drops the uh, launcher after it's been fired uh, because it's back in for normal armor, uh, disposable rockets like the M72 Law, Law or the 84, uh, for some reason um, the developer treat it as a reusable weapon, so you can actually reload it rock with rocket, which is kind of uh, unrealistic. So for parry fire DLC. Uh, they added the animation where your character would dispose the uh, rocket once it's been fired. Then we are we're at the grenade range. So we got incendiary, willy peed, frag grenade, and uh, CS gas. On the teams, we normally carry about 16 grenades, frags, smoke, incendiary and Willie Pete. They all have important uses. Learn each one. So they um wild carrot just said they normally normally carries about 16 grenades. So I'm not sure whether that's 16 for the whole team of uh, six or 16 per individual. So now I'm gonna try out the uh, frag grenades. Fire in the hole. I think I overshot the trench. Yep, I did. Again. Okay. Uh, now we're gonna try out the Willy Pete. Well, Willy Pete is uh, white phosphorus. It's a toxic uh, material when uh, combust, uh, which uh, and also gives out the uh, white smoke, and it's used for us. Uh, for smoke screen or smoke grenades. Okay, now I'm gonna get myself a uh, gas mask because <laughs> I'm gonna try out these CS gas. Well, without like a uh, live uh, or AI enemy, it's hard to uh, test out the uh, the uh, tear gas. So I guess uh, we can proceed to the uh, mortars. The 60 and 81 millimeter mortars are great for supporting teams outside the wire. They fire HE, Willy Pete, and Looms. 
We normally use what we call debt cons. They're preset firing positions so we can always have a fire mission ready for an enemy attack. But you can use the artillery map for your own fire missions. Or the weapon optics if the VC is close enough to see. Yep, that happens. Wow, that quick pink barrage is just awesome. Okay, let's try the uh, Willy Pete. And this is the uh, 81 millimeter mortar. Okay, it's hard to get into the gunner seat. Oh, there we go. Okay, that was a bit too close. Yeah, that was definitely too close for comfort. Well, here it is, Juan Loy Base Camp. It's near an old rubber plantation, though not much of that's left. They don't call it Rocket City for nothing. And here oh, it shit. is, right on time. Charlie has some mortars out there. 
cover Report to the cover. command bunker and keep your head down. Don't want to catch any shrapnel. Well, the captain is happy to have you here on TDY. He said to take a patrol out and familiarize yourself with the neighborhood. See if you can find those fucking mortars. Gonna get myself a trap kit. Uh, helps detect mines and traps nearby. Gonna save my loadout. These mortars are dropping everywhere. Oh my god, that falls kind of too close for comfort. Okay, easy does it. Use your walk key to go slowly. It'll reduce your noise. And crouch or crawl to be less visible. Out here, noise discipline is key to survival. Only cherries run. Front. There's an enemy. Foot mobile. 200 meters right up ahead. He's down. We have eliminated enemy patrol. As you can see, I'm lo uh, I have selected the uh, 20 round dual mag. Uh, for some reason, uh, it gives me 36 rounds. Uh, all so it combines both magazine together <laughs> into one single magazine. Uh, I wish uh, the developers can do something about it. Like maybe fire 20 to 18 rounds and then a real quick reload for the other 20 or 18 rounds oh shit contact from the hillside gonna move to cover man 75 meters right Uh, looks like a huge crater to the northwest. I see. I see the uh, muscle flash off Standing the uh, mortars. Mortar, one hundred meters front. Move up. On the way. Waiting.
got enemy truck. Gonna bring out my uh, rocket launcher. Shit, did they just throw a grenade? Holy shit, they just engaged my guys with more. You need to charge the motor pit. Good shooting. If you still got any C4, plant it on the tube. We had more time, I'd show you how to use gasoline Move to sabotage meters. one of these. Right. Charlie doesn't know a thing until he goes to drop around in and blows himself and his buddies to pieces. <laughs> they really hate us. Ready. I don't think I have... Uh... I don't think I have any C4 for us, so I just leave it here. See, if you got any C4 plan on the tube, if we have more time, I'll show you how to use gasoline to sabotage one of these. Charlie doesn't know a thing until he goes to drop a round in and blows himself and his body to pieces. <laughs> Move 75 meters, front! I guess I'll cheat a little bit and spawn in a uh, explosive charge. Okay, let's see. Standing by. Is that time to 40 seconds? Let's go. Let's get off here before uh, the charge goes off. I think the time or the inside of the timer, so I'm gonna touch up one bomb. Okay, uh, one more to neutralize. Uh, I don't know how many left, so we. Man, oh shit! I've got him. Okay, we have to locate uh, more mortars. Sounds like coming from the Man, south. 75 meters Shh, front. Jesus. Man, 75 meters front. Machine gunner, 100 meters front. Return to formation. Understood. Target neutralized. I'll flank him. Move 75 meters, right! On the way. Fall back! Roger. I think I hear noise of uh, voices. Is right? Soldier, 200 meters front. Enemy spotted. 
Oh, he, uh, I see him. Right up ahead. Damn, he's on oh, no, that those um sniper platform. That's one team that won't be fucking with us tonight. Good job. Oh shit, I always got stuck. Okay, let's move further south. AT soldier, 75 meters front. We're clear of the uh, motor position, fire in the hole. I can hear them. Contact machine gunner. Where? Target down. Contact soldier. Enemy spot. Soldier. Seventy five meters left. Scratch one. Man, 100 meters front. Cover me, reloading. On the fort. Rifleman, 200 meters. Just up ahead. Soldier, 200 meters front. Pushing forward. Pushing my way further down south. Medic, 75 meters front. front.
AT soldier. 100 meters. Front! Man, 75 meters front. Wow, what happened to those Whoa. guys? Looks like their ammo malfunctioned. Dumb bastards. What was that? Did you hear that? Things going so wrong? No way. Get out of here. Okay, it's time to head back. You do not want to get stuck out here after dark. Easy does it going back into camp. Make sure you don't get shot up by the yards thinking you're a VC. Hey, watch the clear. Your team is needed at the Hold radio the relay. They just killed a sapper in the wire. Okay, we're heading to the uh, radio relay station. Okay, watch the wire to the south. That's where they shot the VC. Move up. Copy. Remember, hey, we're at the relay station. When near a wall or bunker or laying down, you can rest your weapon and hold your breath to stabilize it. Ready. And we're gonna defend it. So as you can see, uh, they have attached like all these like tiny tin cans on the bot wire, and I think they put rocks in it. So when they were um, touched or moved, uh, it rattles. It gives up the noise. So it's like a really um, uh, improvised uh, alarm enemy. system. Officer, seventy-five meters front. Spec up, seventy-five meters front. I've got a visual. Machine gun. Spec up. 200 meters front. Shit, enemy Sniper. just outside the wire. Front. Nail them sons of bitches before they can blow up the wire. 75 meters front. Sniper. 200 meters front. I've got a visual. Machine gun. Sniper. 75 meters front. Officer. Man. 75 meters front. Sniper, spec up, 75 meters front. Sing, uh, Willy Pete. I see move. Oh, he got burned. 200 meters front. Keep going up. Um, uh, I'm all ammo on my uh, rifle, so I'm gonna switch to a shotgun. I just steal his ammo.
Yeah, I got a few magazine from my teammate over there. Machine gunner, 75 meters, front. Got a visual. Soldier, 75 meters front. I think uh, our, the southern perimeter has been cleared. Check on the west. West seems clear as well. Captain said they think there's sappers bypassing this hill and creeping up to the main camp. Check your north. Let's see if we can get a resupply. Gonna switch to my uh, sniper rifle. Let's see what like, we can find. Let's see what we can see over there. Okay, time to call some support. Use your radio action to get some looms on the perimeter. Then call HE on any fucking sappers dumb enough to go for the camp. I get myself a radio as well. And the binoculars. We got enemy movement, uh, range should be around 300. Oh my god, that's a lot of them. Cover. 
Razorback 6. Requesting illumination. Over. Razorback, Covey, Roger. Tell me where you want it. Covey, drop the movement tree line to our new number. Razorback 6, Covey. Air inbound. Oh, Over. 200 meters right. Spec up. 200 meters. Spec up. 200 meters right. Spec up. 200 meters right. Spec up. Machine gun. 300 meters bearing 015. We kind of need some support. Razorback, Roger. Gunship starting their run. Covey, Razorback six. We need air support. Over. Razorback, Covey, Roger. Tell me where you want it. Covey, hammer that tree line to our November. Razorback six, Covey. I see movement. Area inbound. Officer, one mic. Zero one five. Jesus. Spec up. Machine gun. 300 meters. Bearing 015. Razorback 6, Covey. Aircraft to Winchester. RTB. Out. Covey. Razorback 6. We need air support. Over. Razorback. Covey. Roger. Tell me where you want it. Covey. Hammer that tree line to our November. Razorback 6. Covey. Air inbound. One mic. Over. Razorback. Roger. Gunship starting their run. Covey, Razorback 6. We need air support. Over. Razorback. Okay, oh, you better get back shit. to the camp. Where's your coach of a lot of enemies? Remember that tree line to our November. It's going to be busy tonight. Take the wow, time. they got wasted. RTB. Out. Razorback 6, Covey. Air inbound. One mic. Over. Razorback, Roger. Gunship starting their run. Uh, I wish we can call off the airstrike, but it seems too late. Razorback, Roger. Gunship starting to run.
Okay, we're gonna board this transport, which will take us back to the main base. Oh my god, watch where it going, Jesus. Contacts up ahead. Be safe. Take them out and keep driving. Get to the camp. Keep going. Jesus Christ. Where are you going, driver? VC are coming. Get to a bunker and find a machine gun. Where's the driver going? And let me get on top of this uh let me get on top of this tower. Aim just below their muzzle flashes. Use tracers to adjust your shots. Use grenades if you hear them getting close. Remember to check which type you got. Call, uh, support. Here come the cavalry. These guys will take you out of the shit so many times on Come. your tour. Razor back, you six. see him back at Bleeding oh, Air Support. Jesus. Always Over. time of fear. Razor back, Cubby, Roger. Tell me where you want it. Cubby, light up the tree line to our November. Razor back, six, Cubby. Air inbound, one mic. Nope.
Roger. Fast air inbound. Keep your heads down. Covey, Razorback 6. We need air support. Over. Razorback, Covey. No air on standby. Holy shit. So I guess that was art like. Art, uh, art light. Uh, I think it's B-52 bomber. Then try Commando Fault. Covey, Razorback 6. We need air support. Over. Razorback, Covey, Roger. Tell me where you want it. Covey, light up the tree line to our November. Razorback 6, Covey. Air inbound, one mic, over. Danger close. Razorback 6. We need air support. Over. Razorback, Covey, Roger. Tell me where you want it. Covey, hammer that tree line to our November. Well, you did real good for your first Razorback time. Razorback 6, Covey. You might want to ditch this TDY and sign up mic. for a special unit I just joined myself. One of my old Navy buddies is down at the pier. He'll take you to Da Nang. When you get there, ask for FOB4. It's right on China Beach. Tell them Wild Carrot sent you. If I see you in the recon bar, I'll buy you a Savage. Keep your heads down. That looks pretty good out here. Razorback 6, Covey. Aircraft for Winchester. RTB. Out. Covey. Razorback 6. We need air support. Over. Razorback, Covey. Negative. No air on standby. Proceed on mission. Out. Okay, so they did, I guess they denied our air support requests uh, since we have uh, completed our objective. That's a Daisy Cutter, holy shit. Wow.
uh, ta so that's the end of the mission. Uh, so this is the debriefing or the uh, after action report. You arrive in country, familiarize yourself with weaponry, and join the Alpha 1901 at Quang Loi. Your objective was to patrol outside the camp perimeter and assist in defending the camp from a VC-7 battalion. Uh, debrief will be well done. Uh, Alpha 1901 and its regional force of rough puffs successfully dealt with enemy mortars and attack on the relay site and a separate attack on the main camp. So during the war, 18 camps were responsible for protecting the border of South Vietnam from communist forces, bringing men and supplies from the Ho Chi Minh Trail. Eight camps were routinely harassed, attacked, and even overrun by combined VC and NVA forces. So this is it. I hope you guys enjoy uh, our first... Uh, mission or first gameplay with the SOG Perifire DLC. I hope you guys enjoy it and I'll see you around.